Hello and welcome, we're back in Kerbal Space Program. It's a glitch here and we just wanted to do a really quick update on the last Kerbal Space Program video I did. Uh, if you remember correctly, uh, well, if you haven't seen it, go watch it first uh, or this won't make much sense. Um, but if you don't remember, we took a, this vessel to Duna uh, I lost the footage, obviously, to that, but uh, not a problem. You, you saw the action shot, which was um, the Kerbal flying off into space. And I said that that was probably the highest a Kerbal has ever gone uh, by himself in my save file. Um, and while that's accurate, I thought I could one-up myself, as it were. We have hyper-edited ourselves out to uh, Elu. I've actually never flown to Elu uh, legitimately, <laughs> so it's interesting being here anyway. I I've been there before, but never really been out this far. So uh, we're going to wait until night to do this. Uh, we'll do everything, all the prep stuff beforehand. Uh, but we're going to wait until the night side so that we can see if we can eject our Kerbal uh, using RCS as well, uh, using the main sail engine, uh, and send him out of the Kerbal's uh, system. I don't, I don't even think it's possible, but at the very least we'll uh, outdo ourselves. I don't know if Elu... I know it has a lower gravity than, say, Duna, so he'll at the very least go higher, right? I don't even really know. I can check, actually, I think. Uh, let's see. Mass 1.1. Okay. Okay, so uh, point. 172 G's and then if we go ahead and zoom all the way out we're way out here uh, focus view we take a look at Duna it has 0.3 G so at the very least we'll be going higher hopefully we'll escape Elu's orbit I don't think we'll escape uh, Kerbal's Kerbal its orbit the Sun uh, regardless, let's get back out of the map menu and prep this thing, shall we? So, we've got this, we've got that. Okay, so we want to shut down engine. We want to shut down this engine as well, if we can. Looks like it's not going to work. Uh, it shouldn't matter anyway, though. And we'll get our... Oh my gosh. Okay, let's actually take a look at his name. Uh, we sent Jogi Kerman out last time. By the way, I did mention in the last video I wasn't entirely sure how long it took to get to Duna. It turned out it was a year and 43 days. I was able to determine that. I think Kerbal years are 100 days year. I, I'm not entirely certain though. It might actually go up to the 365 system. I doubt it though. Right. Let's do this. Same as last time. And we'll just switch back here. Watch our friends. Oh. I didn't know that. Let's get on the thing. Oh, no. Right. Okay. So I don't know how much RCS fuel it's going to take to get us out of Kerbal's orbit. If it's too much, I, I, I just won't do it. We'll just see how high we can get uh, this Kerbal here. I don't know if we'll be able to watch our friends. Oh, no. They've gone outside of the uh, render range. And have been killed. Let's take a look here. Want to 
switch to. There we go. And change focus. Yeah. Right? Oh, it's gonna make it difficult on me, isn't it? Let's see. Where's the Kerbal Killer probe? Can we focus on that? No. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Um... Tell you what, let's switch to the space center. And go back to the Kerbal Killer probe. Any minute now. Here we go. Just a quick update video today. Don't want to, uh. Don't want to make this a full video. Right, so we want to get to the dark side. And the farthest away from the sun we can be. Let's see. Okay. Hopefully we can switch in time. Come on. There we go. Switch back to our Kerbal here. So, shut down engine so we can get it to max before we do anything. And three, two, one. Woo! Okay. How fast are we moving? Probably just. Was that 500 kilometers per second, probably? Aw, oh, man, we didn't even escape Elu's orbit. That sucks. We can... We could have done better. Come on. I don't think we could have. I mean, will two main sail engines double the power? I don't think so. I don't, I don't think that work, that's how it works on Kerbals. We're not, we're not raising our, well maybe we are, well, it's hard to tell. We can't, we can't continue the RCS while it is, while we're in map view. Are we raising it? 62, I think it was 50 something last time. So we are raising it, I think. 68? Yeah, I think I think we might be able to at least escape Elu's orbit. Gravitational pull, sphere of influence, if it, uh, uh, as it were. Come on. Let's just speed it up here. I'm sorry if that's too flashy. That's a little better. Uh, well, not not much better. Where are we at? Uh, 304. We've definitely broken our old record, that's for sure. Come on, Jogi Kerman. Uh, I don't know if we have enough EVA, EVA propellant. Oh, no. Okay. Let's see where we're at. No! We're so close. Look at that. What is that? Four million meters. So that's... Oh, gosh. I'm going to do my math wrong here. Is that 4,000 kilometers? Oh. 
I'm a imperial guy, unfortunately. Feet, yards, miles, stuff like that. Oh, we, man, I, I tell you what, though, we, sh we really should switch over to metric. It's just so much easier. Oh, man. I went so fast, he collided with... Oh, collided with the surface and didn't die. Twice. Are we going to meet back up with our probe? That should be interesting. I wonder how fast we're going. Probably pretty quick here. Mm. I'd say 500, 600 kilometers. Uh, um, not kilometers. Holy crap. Did I say that earlier, too? 600 meters per second. <laughs> That'd be insane. Uh, where's our craft there? Oh, we're gonna hit the surface. Set as target. Uh, when I, we can't see it. It's too far away. Oh, well. And it's nighttime to boot. Well... I thought maybe we could get into solar orbit. Turns out we can't. Oh well. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you liked it. I'll see you next time. Okay, alright. I couldn't just leave it like that. So we've uh, upgraded the design a bit. What do you think? Uh, I don't know about this one either. I tested it a little bit, but... Oh gosh, too fast. I'm relatively certain we can escape Elu's orbit, but uh, Souls is another story. Saul. That's our son. <laughs> Kerbal. <laughs> That's the one I meant. That's the one it's named after. Okay. So as you can see, we're pretty close to the other one. And... Three, two, one. There we go. We're going to start... Uh, I turned on infinite fuel so that we can uh, get over here. And as you can see, that just destroyed the probe down there. Uh, but we're going to EVA right out of the bat. As you can see, we're going fast, immensely faster already. Um... I'd say that's 800, 900 meters per second. All right. Here we go. I'm just going to keep my finger on the shift button. because, uh, And I'm not going to go into map mode because if we do, we're going to lose thrust. And we want to thrust now while we have the speed already get the Oberth effect, I believe that is called. I don't know if that works going straight up, though. I don't know. Probably. You'd think the same laws would apply. Uh-huh. Alright. Four times time acceleration. Physics time. So we can keep accelerating. Uh, we're already up to... 80 kilometers above Elu. 100 kilometers. There we go. We've escaped Elu's orbit, I believe. That's what the camera did for us there. It's told us that. And we're almost out of EVA fuel. Alright. Let's see where we're at. Okay, so obviously we've gone outside of the orbit. But... We are still in orbit around Kerbal. Uh, I believe that's because we actually burned in the wrong direction. If we had put enough power into it, we could have escaped, I think. Yeah, even that traje trajectory, but that wasn't the most efficient burn, I think. I still don't think we can make it. I don't think we can make it out of the Kerbal system. I don't know what it takes at this altitude to get uh, get out of it, but I don't think it's possible with just a Kerbal pack. 
uh, I think we used eight, uh, no, no, nine of those, um, oh my gosh, mainsail engines, and still it's not possible. Oh well, I thought it'd be neat. We're gonna send him off on his little journey, forever to drift in space, alone, cold, undying, unwavering Kerbal, deep in the cosmos. Yeah, anyway, seriously, I'm going now this time. Really, the end plate's gonna play now. No, really, I promise. Okay, bye.